Today we're back with another Black Ops 2 custom map. Yes, there are more of them. I'm quite surprised as well, but this time we're playing one called City of Mars V2. This takes the Nuketown Zombies map that we all know and love, and it completely transforms it, adding new perks, a whole new area to the map, a new wonder weapon, actual working traps, which by the way look kind of insane, and a full-on easter egg quest as well. Man, these Black Ops 2 custom maps are just so good, and it's crazy because there's not really that many, so let's quit the yapping and let's get into the game. Okay, so here we are on City of Mars. This is on Nuketown. Test subject is advancing to phase one. Hello? What is going on? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, are the rockets actually taking off? What? That's actually sick. Ah, I see. Test subjects have woken up. Glad to see at least someone's still alive. Ha! Others have already perished a long time ago. Anyways. Dude, what the heck? Why do these have, like, insane lights coming out of them? Wait! You actually have to shoot those? Okay, we figured something out. Uh, we must take revenge. You can help me with that. Yes? Start off by decapitating every dummy's head. I'll see if I can locate the floating head for you after that. So we have to shoot all of the heads off of the mannequins, it seems like. We also have some new zombie models here. By the way, this just looks so crazy because of how colorful it is. <laughs> I'm so used to Nuketown being so, like, I guess, dull, almost? <laughs> I don't know if that's the right word, but, uh, it, you know, this is insanely colorful. Uh, it's quite the difference so uh, let's go ahead and kill some of these zombies here well we actually i thought that was a santa claus zombie for a second <laughs> i was gonna say wait that doesn't really fit the vibe of the map dude look at those effects by the way so let's start shooting these heads real quick i i'm assuming they're only gonna be the ones that have the lights on them so let's look out for those we have one there also i didn't hear a quicker by fall so i wonder if that's already on the map or if um i just missed that but i guess we'll find out look at this we got the pink truck that's actually kind of sick oh there's one in there got him and we have the bowie knife the claymores uh i'm pretty sure it's the same things right as always let's find out uh some texas 74u yeah 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 oh so are the phases just the round then i thought those were separate wait is there really no round in the bottom left i thought i seen round one there i guess not okay so i was wondering what the phases were for i thought that was like for the easter egg but i guess that's literally just the round Oh, what the? Wait, we started with the B23R2? Wait, what? Damn, this camo looks good. What is this, Black Ops 3 starting off with the RK5 vibes? What's going on here? I will say, starting off with the RK5 on Black Ops 3 is extremely helpful. So it's pretty nice we do start off with it here. What's going on here? What is this? <laughs> okay. TV showing some insane stuff. Okay, cool. Access denied from test subjects. Await further instructions. What is in there? Is it? I don't even know. I don't even want to imagine what's in that crystal thing. Oh, let's see what we got in here. I, I did see there's a bunch of them back here. Oh, whoa, whoa. Come back later. Okay, okay, okay. Double points. Perfect. That's exactly what I want. All right, let's get it. Hey, the Galil, I'll take that. Let's get rid of the M1911. Yeah, these camos look sick. Look at this. I actually haven't even run into Quick Revive. Uh, I don't know if I missed it. I, I guess I'll go take a look again. But I did not hear anything drop from the top, which slightly concerns me. <laughs> I, I don't want to. I don't want to die here. So yeah, we'll go look out in the actual main area in a second. I will say the skybox looks beautiful, dude. Wow. Ah, oh, not a nuke. I don't even think I have enough for the other door. Oh, oh, I thought that didn't end the round. I thought I heard another zombie spawn in. That's a mannequin. Um, yeah, because Kokorov is not there. It's not there. Wait, whoa, whoa, it's on fire. Oh, I thought, I thought I had to buy it or something. It's definitely not in there. We checked there. I see another mannequin here. I think this is the last area it can be, and it's not there either. Um, okay. Well let's move on to this house we have another one of these glowy things oh this area is blocked off whoa there's like a bunker in there uh can i get some perks please i'm scared okay so there's another one i highly doubt this is gonna be the last one yeah there's probably some outside come back later we have a head here <laughs> they're just floating heads <laughs> So, um, I'm pretty sure we shot all of the mannequin heads 
that are inside of the map. I don't think I missed any. We're going to have to look outside the map now. I'm pretty sure the last couple of ones are going to be out here. Oh, yep. There, speaking of, there's one right there. Oh, and there's another one up there. Oh, can I open this door, though? Oh, I can. So, yeah, there's like a... Um, Ooh, actually, I'm gonna open that right now. Oh, that's such a bit. Why? <laughs> I just got pranked. Now I can't leave this area. Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. Nice, dude. Nice. Oh, perfect. The max ammo. Oh, no. I didn't actually see the nuke there. Dude, I literally just got pranked. Oh, but now we can leave. I feel a lot safer over on the green side, so I'm just gonna leave this area. But on my way out, I'm gonna see if there's any other heads. Not that I see. They gotta be outside the map now. I really hope this game isn't glitched with the perks. Because how have I not found any? <laughs> that is still concerning me. I'm gonna shoot these off just in case. I mean, it seemed like it was only the ones that have the lights coming out of them. But I, you know, I just want to have everything covered. There's one here, though. Oh, that one you can't even shoot off. What about these? No. We haven't gotten anything else from Ted. It's funny that Ted's communicating with us, by the way. But we haven't, uh... Haven't gotten anything else. So let me check this again. It still doesn't say anything. Um... I mean, I made the box again. Screw it. Might as well. I don't know what else to do. Ah, yes. The SMR. Wait, the LSAT? I'll take that, sure. Gonna blow up the generator. I don't know if that does anything. So yeah, no quick revive. Like, what is this? A no perk challenge? Oh, shoot. I thought that zombie was gonna kill me. Bro. Oh my god. Is this the last one? No, it isn't. I did it. That one didn't even have a light. What? Okay, whatever. Z <laughs> Oh, great. All the mannequins are not headless. Wonder bar. Haha. -ha. Anyways, what took you so long? Okay, dude. I've already teleported the head for you, but I can't remember where I left it at. Take a look around the area. See if you can find it. Is that dead ops music? I think that is. Hey, so it got teleported somewhere. Uh, let's see where it went. Is it over here? Come back later. So this is one head location and then there's one in the back of the other house. Let's go check that one. Before we go, though, I think I'm gonna hit the box. Let's see what we get. Maybe a uh, ray gun mark two would be nice. Oh, no way. <laughs> gimme, gimme. Oh, so there is a head here. Okay, let's see. Come back later. Wait, do I pick this up or something? Oh, I do. Okay, so I held F on that. It didn't actually have like a box or something. Ah, you found a great success. Barbecue the head at the front of the bunker. Someone's waiting for you. Someone's waiting for me. <laughs> All right, let's go do that. We gotta go barbecue the head. Oh, well, that's that head. Oh, two heads. Wait, what? Okay, so what now? <laughs> okay <laughs> that scared the hell out of me i thought i died imagine if it would have showed game over screen okay so who's this do i shoot it no okay well can i do something with this now no huh but i am holding f and kind of interacting with it to see if maybe that changes something so i need souls aha still no perks i'm very very afraid but i feel a little bit better now that i have this mark too Still, though, back here is kind of crazy sometimes. How far can I be from it? I got to be close. Okay, so let's um, slowly take them over here. Honestly, I don't really have to worry about points. Like, points don't really mean much. I can't really buy anything. I wonder if, like, maybe in this bunker, it'd be cool if we can go to some other area. I don't know. I, I haven't seen anything on this map, by the way. I'm also playing this for the first time, so I'm not sure. I mean, maybe there is a new area. That would be pretty cool if there was. But, I mean, I will find out. We'll find out. Okay. Oh, there we go. Whoa. <laughs> the mannequin just blew up. So, oh, never mind. Ted's talking now. What? How are you not dead? Lucky you, I assume. But I must admit that you did a good job on repairing that bunker. The bunker shows any power to teleport again. Go buy some drinks now. We are not done yet. Ha ha. Okay, so go buy some drinks now. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Drinks are on Ted, boys. Everybody, everybody get your drinks. So now let's go check the other side where the other bunker is at in that room to see if maybe now that's something. 
Are we really gonna get teleported to another area? Because I haven't seen a single damn perk on this map so far, so. I'm promised drinks. Are the drinks really there? So the doors are open. What? Perk heaven? Wait, what? Wait, wait. <laughs> wait, 2,000 for this, hello? Inflation hit Mars crazy. What? Okay, so, oh, hold up. Go straight to Jug and Pap location, cost 100. I suppose I forgot to tell you something. Come and stop by at the bunker when you're not busy. Knock on the door, should wake me up for my beauty sleep. What? I need to sleep too. <laughs> Ted sleeping is kind of curse. So I guess I can only go to... Oh, oh, I'm dead. So double tap. It sucks I can't get the 100 points. If not, I would definitely go by Jug, but I don't think I can. So you can just jump to the other areas. What? <laughs> this is sick. Dude, is that where Pack-a-Punch is at? It's so far. And also, how do I get back? I wonder if there's anything in between, like, this area and Jug, because... Oh, snap. There's, like, a lot of space in between all this stuff, so... I guess we'll kind of adventure, see what happens. Why well, you jump way too far. My timing is off by a lot. There we go. So, yeah, there's something on that side. I gotta start jumping, like, really far back. Oh, you know what? I wonder if I just skip the first one and just go to the second one. Nope, not how it works. <laughs> okay, so, yeah, this is a fail. Dude, what is this? I can't get anywhere. I guess we'll just teleport to Jug then. Wait, hold on. If I go backwards, does it take me to this side now? Please tell me it does, because if not, I'm stuck at Speed Cola. Okay, perfect. So, let's just go straight to Jug. Yeah, straight to Jug. Oh, it's the light pole. Aha, okay, so Jug. Oh, what is this? What do we got here? Upgrade your bullet type. 20,000? So Quick Revive is the only one that's expensive. What the flip, dude? <laughs> it's 2,000? Okay, well, let's just get back to the city of Mars then. So let's go knock on the bunker again. We'll come back, we'll come back. It seems like we can just go whenever we want, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least I, it seems like it. Oh, snap. Hold on, did the round end? Oh, bro, I forgot. I left a bunch of zombies. Wow, so there is actually, like, a whole different part of this map. I love it. I love it. So let's see what Ted wants us to do now. Ah, so we're ready to move forward with our plan. We can eavesdrop on Griffin Station and see what they're really up to. See if you can get a signal through the television. Listenable frequency should be 84701. So I'm assuming it means this one. 84701. Warning, Ballista, Mr. Inbound. Okay, uh, what? I'm just... Oh, no, did you hear that? It's another attack from Griffin Station. Brace for signal loss. So we, lo right, we lost Ted. Ted's gone. Ted's dead. It's over, guys. I'm not staying indoors anymore. I want to see what's happening. Wait, did a nuke just hit there? Bro, what is this? Hello? Bro, this looks so nice. Wait, so what's up with the boxes then? Wait, do I gotta blow this up? Hold on, let, let's toss some grenades. Oh, whoops, that one completely backfired. Or we have to collect more souls. I don't think we have to blow it up though. I guess we'll check. Yeah, let's uh, let's kill a zombie near it. Yeah, okay, it's souls. I don't know why I thought we had to maybe blow it up. So it seems like there's a couple of these soul boxes. At the end of this round two, I guess we'll go teleport back to Perk Heaven so we can actually get a setup. We should have enough by the end of this round. I really did not expect this map to be like this. It has completely like surpassed my expectations by a lot. By the way, this map is made by the same developers that made Transit Reimagined. If you guys remember that one, it changes a lot of things that most people wouldn't like about transit, like actually being able to sprint the entire time. There's no fog, no denizens. Uh, the jet gun is really good. I played that one a really long time ago, and I really didn't. Um, I didn't play for that much. I played it a little bit on stream with you guys. That was back when I streamed on YouTube. That one is really, really good as well. I definitely recommend you guys check out both of these maps, bro. This is awesome. I really am insanely impressed by this. Holy crap. I'm so glad that it doesn't cost anything to get in here again. 
Besides having to pay $100 to get teleported. So yeah, we'll buy Jug. Um, I'm not going to be able to buy Speed Cola, though. Wait, so once you teleport here... Am I dead? Please don't, I'm not dead. Okay, perfect. I really want to try to get around the map, but it's actually hard. It is not as easy as you would expect. You jump... It's like you think you're going to jump a certain distance, but you don't. Wow, that takes you really high. You have to kind of start way back here, like right here. Yeah, per wow, perfect. So does this take you really high? No, it doesn't. That that one does. So I'm going to start there. That's not at all what I meant to do. No! Dude, half of this video is going to be trying to do some parkour. Because you can see things on that area of the map. It's not like there's nothing there. Like, you can see things on that side. You see those red lights? Now, those red lights could mean nothing, as they could just be like these. More than likely, they are just nothing. But I'm curious. That's perfect. Okay, so now we're going to go boom. That's right on the money. Right on the money. Right on the money. <laughs> Let's go, man. So this takes me really far up. Do I jump on the rock? <gasps> no. It's like I'm playing only up a Black Ops edition. Oh, so this just... Oh, what the flip? Oh, what the, what, what's the point of... So there's nothing here. There's ju It's just to get to Jug. Like, there's no other reason. Huh. Okay, interesting. I guess this part of the map is... I, I thought there were going to be, like, some cool rewards by getting here. Maybe, like, a free perk or something of the sorts. That would be a pretty cool one. Kind of like how Revelations has it. I missed this completely. Yeah. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Let's go. So yeah, I mean, hey, just you just land here. Okay, cool. So we're chilling now. I will say I kind of wouldn't mind getting a max ammo because I'm kind of low. If anything, I might have to get rid of the Galil, unfortunately. Whenever you're in this area, I think they all come from this side in front of you. I don't think they spawn behind you at all. Oh, double points. That would be good if I... Oh, max ammo, there it is. Nice, nice, nice. Perfect. Oh, they do spawn behind you. Never mind, I was wrong. Damn, I really need speed cola. I'm... <laughs> no. Oh my goodness. Oh wait, I didn't even finish that other side. Wait, so how many souls do we need? We must need a lot. Wait, why am I on this side? <laughs> that one still needs souls. Okay, I'm an idiot. I really don't know why I just left that area. Okay, whatever, dude. Oh, so the light goes from red to like yellowish i was kind of hoping that there'd be some new perks like stamina up or mule kick or something like that maybe even like electric cherry i don't even know if that's possible or even phd would be cool not like nitpicking i just kind of i was hoping for that it's kind of it's kind of cool whenever they add perks like that but the pack a punch is instantaneously that's pretty cool so what kind of camo is this are those oh oh that's cool it's like rocket ships and planets and whatnot that's kind of cool <laughs> So we got this one done. Looks like whenever they get the green light, that means uh, they're done. So let's go over to the other side now. We'll go back to the generator area that we're in because we already filled up some of those souls. Yeah, Speed Cola makes this area way more manageable. Okay, we should be very close to finishing this. Oh boy, hell no. No! My freaking ray gun mark 2 didn't reload on time. No way. I'm gonna grab this so I can get the souls. And then we're gonna go to perk heaven. Come on. The good thing is that we don't have to worry about buying these perks mid-round. So that's one down already. Ripperonis. Let's get jug and then we'll also pack a punch to mark 2. Look at that. I love the instantaneous pack a punch. We need double tap and then we need speed cola. Damn. Yeah, I kind of expected that. I'm kind of an idiot. I, I need to stop trying to hoard kill there because I hoarded too many. <laughs> and then when I tried to kill the excess, it didn't work. <laughs> I just like got immediately wrecked. So, oh, wait, we need to go this way now. Oh, wait, can I teleport to Mars from here? No, I don't think I can, right? I got to go to pack a punch and then come back. Okay. 
Oh my goodness, they're all over there. <gasps> Holy crap. Oh, we're done with it. Dog round? Hold up, let me... Oh, the rocket just landed. Elon Musk! Move! I want to see the rocket! No, I couldn't see it. Well, hello again. Glad to see you're still breathing. Thanks for getting the power back on. Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to continue our revenge plan. Shit, give me a second. Okay. Yeah, all the rockets landed. Or I guess... Oh, those are the generators. I guess we'll wait on Ted. So it was going to tell you before the signal got interrupted. Oh, yeah, I noticed that some explosives had spawned around the map. If I remember correctly, you need to nade them in a correct order. Destroy the explosive cores. Hold on. For that, we're going to... We're going to save a zombie. Oh, he's talking more. Let's see. I forgot to tell you about the traps that I fixed for you. Traps called Soul Seeker. Hold up. I can't read. Soul Seeker and Tesla Void unlocked. Enjoy the little tree. Now get back to work. Soul Seeker and Tesla Void. So, yeah. Hold on. We're going to have to wait on that, Ted. Your, your little, our little revenge plan's gonna have to wait a second. <laughs> I almost just got wrecked reading that. Okay, so I wonder if that's what these are then. Like, what is this? Oh, it is! Hold up to activate CD protectors. So what, is this something now? No, it's still not. So the heads, the heads mean something. So this is gonna be the soul seeker, right? Oh, Buzzshot. I guess we'll... Do that trap activated so what does this do <laughs> i'm shocked as to what i'm seeing right now okay that's badass <laughs> this is so cool actual working traps on nuketown Okay, so that one looked kind of nice. It kind of took up the whole area of the backyard too, so it's actually usable. <gasps> so those are the explosives Ted's talking about. So there's one. Let's go take a look at the locations first, and then we'll try to figure out a way to solve this. Oh, that's the other explosive. And there's another one. Wait, but that one's not flashing. This is the only one that's kind of flashing. See how that one's got like some orange on it? All the other ones didn't have orange. This one over here doesn't have orange. Unless it's just the effect of that specific area. Wait, what? Do I have to shoot with the rake the ray gun? Wait. Or is this not the first one we start off with? Oh, that one's not blowing up. Let me open this truck. I'll just buy some Texas. So that one didn't blow up. Let's try this one. Do I have to stick it right on it? <laughs> that <laughs> kind of went through it. Okay. So that one made some kind of noise. Now let me throw this one over here. Oh, fudge. That one got too close. Oh, there's another one there. The green one. So let me uh, try this one. This one's flashing too. Okay, that one's not. Wow, how am I supposed to hit this one? How am I supposed to hit that one? It just goes right through. Can I shoot it? Oh no. I guess one thing I could do as well. Like what if I throw it up and upon landing? I'm such <sighs> my the the way my brain works is insane. Well, now let's try this one. Okay, so that one you still can't activate. So far, we've done two. Okay, still not that one. Ah, it's up there. Let's see. Okay. Ah, it's over there. Sweet, 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 sweet. We still need to find out what the heck the soul seeker is. You know, it was a snow snap. Snow, I guess. <laughs> I think it's a soul. It's a, was it a soul seeker or soul sneaker? <laughs> it was not a soul sneaker. <laughs> so that's that explosive thing done. 
So now, okay, that was that was it. That was it. You really took your time, huh? Damn, Ted's calling me out. Oh well, at least the explosive cores are collected now. Wait a minute, I think there's one more floating somewhere in Perk Heaven. Go locate the bomb whenever you can. Okay, so let's go to Perk Heaven then. But before we move on, let me hit the box. Maybe we'll get something good. Oh, the M27. Oh, I'm taking that. I'm taking that for sure. The M27 is a must-have weapon on this map, dude. It's so good. I wish this would be on more maps, but unfortunately it isn't. So let's see. There's something floating. Oh, see, good thing I practiced jumping on these pads earlier. By the way, I hope you guys enjoyed the April Fool's video I made. Like I said in the comment section, I, I haven't made a single April Fool's video, and I feel like that's a... I feel like it's a lost art in today's day and age. Like, like I was actually checking to see if anybody made a April Fool's video. I mean, I guess for a good reason, because April Fool videos are kind of cringe a little bit. But, um, you know, I, I didn't see a single YouTuber that I actually watch do an April Fool's video. So, you know, I thought, hey, I'm just going to have some fun here. And let's just play some something else. Um, I haven't made a video like that ever, so it was just interesting. And, um... Yeah, I just hope you guys enjoyed it. It was, it was fun to make. Oh, bro, you always jump ahead. No! Oh, interact with it. I'm an idiot. I gotta, forget. I gotta remember that. Very nice! You found it! I guess it was a little bit further away from the other ones. Yes, it was. We need to get access to those electric knifey thingies. Place down the bomb at... Hmm. At its location? We need to get access to those electric knifey thingies. So, Galva Knuckles. Do I just like... Oh, there we go! Oh, that's so cool. So is that going to blow up? <laughs> it does. <laughs> Fantastic job. I'm surprised that bomb didn't explode on you while you were carrying it. What the flip? Dude, Ted's trying to set me up. You can try hitting those electric boxes besides both houses. And eh, regular melee attack would not work with this one. Ah, what the flip, dude? So I got to save up money. That's fine. We got to buy the Galvas. So electric boxes. Is it really this? I think it was. So where's the other electric box on this side? Oh, wait. If we really think about it, that power is connected to this. Do I just hit this? Oh, my. I broke my brain. I need to be studied. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. By the way, whenever I say things like that, I'm just kidding. That's got to be the two. Oh. Ah, everything's so bright again. Haha. -ha. Those generators should be powered now. I think we'll need to override launch control lockdowns. Pack up some heat before we try overriding them. Wow, the difference in how the map looks now is crazy. You can see everything again. So I'm guessing that what we gotta do now is those little boxes that we found in the houses earlier. Well, let's just try one. Sure. Yeah. Oh, I thought it said infinite lockdown. I was going to be like, holy crap, what do you mean infinite lockdown? But it's just a normal one. Please don't spawn behind me. Just stay in front of me, please. Nope. Of course they're behind me. Oh, the mannequin popped out of nowhere. What's happening with the mannequin? See that? Mannequin's popping in and out. Now, I was considering like waiting for Pack-A-Punch, but I kind of wanted to do this now. Just because, why not? Can we get a drop anywhere? Any drop baronies? <gasps> nice! Okay, I'm gonna have to buy the MP5 for ammo's sake. Oh, I can go all the way over here. Well, there's a bunch of mannequins just popping in and out. That's kind of cool. Another nuke! I, I did unfortunately have to get rid of the M27. This was, I definitely should have just waited for Pack-A-Punch. There we go. We actually did it. Permanent perk rewarded PhD Flopper. Dude, what? There is actual PhD. I was talking about this. No way. And the monkey bombs. Can things get any better? By the way, we just got three nukes back to back. Whoa, look at that. PhD Flopper. I guess... Yeah, before we do this other lockdown, I'm going to actually get a good weapon. And I also wouldn't mind waiting for a max ammo, maybe. Just so that I can get some ammo in the Mark II, because it's kind of it's kind of low. I don't know. What else What else could I get? 
Oh, the hammer is not bad. Hammer's pretty pog. Monkey bombs are going to help a lot with this lockdown. It seems like it takes about, well, like a minute-ish. Somewhere around there. I didn't keep count because I was on the edge of my sea half the time. Because my ammo was running extremely low. But yeah, it didn't really take that long. It's funny because every time there's something intense that goes on, whether it's a boss fight or a lockdown or something, in an easter egg on one of these custom maps, it always feels like it's so long. But then, like when I'm editing, I realize, dude, this is only like five minutes or even like less sometimes. So it's just crazy how intense some of these maps get. Part of me kind of wants to keep the hammer. I guess, right? It's not really a weapon I use too often, so I wouldn't mind keeping it for this game. I do eventually want to get that ammo type. Um, I just got to get enough. 20k is kind of expensive. I got to save up quite a bit. So let's initiate this sequence now. Oh, so this time I can't even go to that area. But I can stay at the top. I'm going to stay at the top. Yeah, so they spawn kind of everywhere. Fire sale. Pretty useless drop. Ah, these mannequins. Ah! Wait, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I can't see. No! I'm, I was stuck, I couldn't see. Bro, I'm stuck again. I think these mannequins are screwing me over. I can't throw a monkey bum. Yeah, because the mannequins are like everywhere. <laughs> so it kind of like blocks you, I think. Oh, I didn't buy claymores. I should have got the claymores. Oh, Max Ammo is beautiful. Here, I'm going to throw a monkey bum again. Oh, man. Okay, there we go. Jeez. Permanent perk rewarded. Oh, stamina up. Uh, all the perks are yours to keep forever. I've spawned a wonder weapon for you. Go find it. I'll prepare the final rocket for you while you have fun. I'll be waiting. Bruh, stamina up. Let's go. That, that maximum at the end absolutely saved my ass. Wow. I cannot believe that maximum came in clutch right when I needed it, dude. Let's see. Is it by the bunker? No. He spawned it in. Oh, right here. The Doomstick. Doomstick will return to its original spawn upon losing the weapon. Oh, shoot. No way. This is kind of like a Gersh. Bro, this is so sick. This is so sick. It does also seem like we are at the end of the Easter egg already, as Ted is pretty much waiting for us to do one more thing, I think. So... Let's just have some fun here. I want to actually try the ammo type. Wow, double max ammo. Look at this. Um, yeah, I do want to try the ammo type and stuff just to see what that actually means. Now, unfortunately, I think that's going to mean that I'm going to have to get rid of one of these weapons. And I'm definitely not getting rid of the Doomstick. We're going to have to get rid of the Mark II, though. So, a little bit later on, I guess I'll just pick up another weapon. I don't know what weapon to get. I, I probably won't trade out just yet because I need to get 20k. We still have a good amount to get. So, um, yeah, once we actually get that 20k... We'll go see what the ammo types are. And I, I guess that's it for the map, man. I'm just going to train. Oh, but you don't get any points. Ah. Okay, so we'll use the Mark II then. I didn't realize that. I'll take the nuke, sure. I'm so surprised I lived <laughs> those lockdowns. Because it was sketchy as hell. That was wild, bro. <gasps> wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What's that? Hello? What is that? 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 Oh no, that's the ending to launch all the rockets. Oh. So at least we know the location of that. Oh, before we leave, actually, let me test this out. So the city protectors. Let's see what this is. I didn't see anything. No way! Mannequins! Dude! This is so damn cool. They actually... <laughs> they just go into the map and protect you. 
And they actually just float around shooting the Mark II. That's so sick. Oh, the SMR. You know what? Let's do the SMR. Screw it. We'll see what the ammo types do to the SMR. Yeah, this thing is... This thing is interesting, to say the least. Will ammo types be able to save the SMR? We'll find out. So, I hope I've done everything on the map. I don't think that I missed anything. It's always... It's always kind of hard to tell. I looked around the map and everything, and it seems that there's nothing else. But, um, here, let's see. Can I pack a punch? No, I can't. Okay. Kind of expected that a little bit, so let's pack a punch the SMR. We got the Smiler. And then let's try out the ammo type. So upgrade your... Bu oh, no, it's not ammo type. I don't know why I said that. It's bullet type. Eh, it's kind of the same thing. Let's see. You've acquired tracer bullets? Upgraded bullets will become available once you teleport back to... Okay, okay. And you could actually do it again. So tracer bullets. Interesting. Uh, I wonder if we should take a look around here just to see if I'm missing anything. Because I haven't really checked this area too much although whenever we whenever we did that nuke step i did pretty much go everywhere and i didn't see anything so i think we're i think we're good i hope i didn't miss anything though so let's go back to the city of mars let's see what these tracers are all about oh okay that's pretty much what i expected literally tracers oh wait oh what the S oh wait, but it's it's the pack a punch SMR. Wait, is this how good the normal SMR is? I rarely use the SMR that much, so I don't even know, but this thing is insane. It's like a ray gun. Unless it literally just gives you ray gun shots now. Like Mauser shots, I guess you could say. This is literally just an SMR ray gun. <laughs> this thing is awesome! No way. Oh, the zombie's stuck. I'll help you out there a little bit. I guess it's time to uh Time to launch the rocket. Let's see what this does. So let, let's look over here. Mission failed. Crew betrayal? Wait, what do you mean? Wait. Did I win? Did I win? <laughs> Crew betrayal? Your perishment is inevitable? Wait! No! What? Did Ted betray me? Wait, Ted betrayed me! <laughs> wait, <laughs> wait. <laughs> We got the bad ending. <laughs> no. That is City of Mars here. Let me stop the timer. I always forget to stop the timer. But that is City of Mars B2. Uh, if you guys do want to check it out, again, it's going to be linked down below in the description, like always with these maps. But I also really like these textures here. Uh, look at this. This looks really nice. The actual icon for Nuketown. Look at this. It's purple. That's sick, dude. And, and he kind of changes to orange. Ah, oh, dude, nice. Nice little touches there that just makes it feel quality. This is a quality map, dude. Hope you guys did enjoy. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Have a good one. Peace out, fellas. Peace, 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 peace. Check out this map. Beat it, boys. Get to run 50 with it. Boom, boom, boom. By the way, I don't know if I was supposed to die there. I hope I did that right. I don't know. But I'll catch y'all later. This Easter egg was awesome. I do also want to give a huge shout out to all the YouTube members, the Twitch subscribers, and the Discord boosters. I appreciate your guys' support. You guys are absolutely amazing. So shout out to Taters, Chicky Cheeses, The Scrub Lords, Red, Ash, Nut King Called, FN40, Muscle, Creek, Dutch Terminator 7, Sappy Xville, Knuckles Vivo, one Evan Flames one, the Big J six, the Zombie Guru, Joff underscore Easybots, it's Noxty seven eleven, Uncle Nikolai, Arno, and Jake Snuffbuster. I appreciate you guys so much for the support. And if you guys are interested in supporting the channel even further, make sure to check the links down below in the description. I appreciate it so much.